Another gross-out TV commercial, and <laughs> if you ask me, this one's much worse than the last. See the iPhone's 12 apps of Christmas. Can the Euros compete with America in TV watching? And on the sports TV news, who is the most influential person in sports? It's all ahead, and much more on the TV news. This is the TV news, the industry's only daily video report, brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative needs, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution. Welcome to the TV news.tv for Friday, December 18th, and here are today's top stories. With tonight being the last night of Hanukkah, and with Christmas being but one week away, we thought we'd open up by going totally holiday on you. Yes, Virginia, there is an app for that. The holidays, we mean. And you'll know what we mean when you see Apple's holiday-themed iPhone TV spot. Have a look. On the 12th day of Christmas, my iPhone gave to me 12 cookies cooking, 11 cards ascending, 10 gifts for giving, 9 songs for singing, 8 bells for ringing, 7 slopes of ski, 6 games for playing, 5 gold rings. Four hot lattes, three flights home, two feet of snow, and an app that can light up the tree. So traditional, so edgy, so effective. Bravo Apple and happy holidays. In late October, we reported the launch of the new CNN.com and true to form, if you build it, rather rebuild it, they will come. CNN is reporting that CNN.com 2.0 has moved 6% more video streams than at this time last year. And that figures as the site has been reconstructed to be video driven. With this elevated web traffic, CNN now claims that CNN.com is busier than perennial top performers Wikipedia and Weather.com. And this comes straight from our international desk. Yesterday we told you about the rise in popularity of TV in America. And this also seems to be the case across the pond. Television consumption in the UK has reportedly risen about 3% to 3.8 hours of TV watched per day. That's more than most of the rest of the continent, which watches about 3.5 hours of TV a day. But no one can compare with America. Mm -mm. We're at number one in the world in TV consumption. 4.6 hours per day. Way to go, USA, I think. And once again, we close the feedback loop. The other day we showed you a TV spot that some claim to be the grossest ever. Well, some of you who responded via LinkedIn groups and Facebook, well, you agreed, but many did not saying they were much worse out there. And voiceover guy Craig Young of the UK's Audio Animation put his gross out link where his mouth was by hooking me up with this atrocity. Rat poison, just one of the dangerous ingredients that may be found in fake medicines purchased from illegal websites. Yuck. Okay, Craig, I think you win. Can anyone top that? If you think you can and the spot is within reason, send me the link at Grimshaw at the TV News TV. The Sports TV News is brought to you by Store & Associates, sports and entertainment marketing specialists. Log on to storeandassociates.com and start connecting with sponsors and consumers. Every Friday we hit you with the Sports TV News. The Sports Business Journal has released their list of the top 50 most influential in sports. Let's work backward from number four. That's honorable mention, and that's NBA Commissioner David Stern. Taking the bronze is ESPN and ABC sports president George Bodenheimer. The silver was awarded to NFL commish Roger Goodell. And bringing home the gold as the top influencer in sports 
was International Olympic Committee President Jacques Rogue. And now, we invite you to look at the rest of the top 10 most influential in sports. And here's a great holiday gift for any tennis fan, like me, suffering from off-season tennis withdrawal, courtesy of the Tennis Channel, no less. Starting Monday, Tennis Channel, home of the slams, serves up eight nights of Grand Slam final singles from the 2009 season. You get the men's and women's single finals from the Australian Open, Roland Garros, or as you Americans say, the French Open, Wimbledon, and the U.S. Open. Via TennisChannel.com, tennis fans have ranked these finals with the number one ranked final airing on December 28th. Anyone think that that's going to be the marathon Wimbledon final between Annie Roddick and Roger Federer? You can pretty much bet the mortgage on that one. What an ace of a holiday gift, and I for one thank you, Tennis Channel. And finally, it may not be the biggest budget or the sexiest ad that will air in Super Bowl 44 on CBS, but it could be one of the most important. The U.S. Census Bureau will attempt to grab your attention during the big game to remind you and everyone else that your 2010 U.S. Census questionnaire will be arriving on your doorstep in short order. So as a public service to the U.S. Census Department, we urge you to watch for this ad in Super Bowl 44 and then, well, stand up and be counted. Future events and opportunities brought to you by Dude Walker. Get the best voice, get the best price. Get Dude at DudeWalker.com. And here's a programming note for you from the TV News.TV. Now, traditionally, the TV trades go dark during the holidays. But as the new kid on the block and the only place in town who delivers the TV news in our native tongue, and that's video, will remain on the job during the holidays, save of course for Christmas Day and New Year's Day. And we've got a surprise or two for you over the holidays, so we hope you'll join us. But in the meantime, have fun, relax, but if you wish, stay informed when the spirit moves you. December is slipping away fast and the new year will be on us before you know it. And in January, the 2010 NatB Market and Conference happens. To register or for more information, log on to natbmarket.com. And that's about it for today's edition of the TV News. We'll be back on Monday with the only daily video newscast about the TV industry for the TV industry. And we've got Tech Talk and the Big Picture all teed up for you. Until then, you can catch up and keep up with us on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. Thanks for watching. Happy last night of Hanukkah, and go out and make it a great weekend. The TV News has been brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative challenges, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution.